Hello everyone, welcome back to Season 10 of The Infected. In today's episode, what we're going to do is we are going to work on mineral extractor placement over here. We're going to work on that. We're trying to think of um, an area to build the base at. So what I'm, or the, the little village that I plan on building. I'm going to keep it connected to the base. To a degree. It's going to be out here in the open area here. It's going to be out here. Let me place some foundations down and I'll show you guys where the like little village is going to be here. It needs to be past this one. And we're just going to make like little little town huts um, out here. One, two, three, four. What if we go four this way? Nah, because that's going to intersect that. Um, This line has to go. Sorry, everyone. This line has to go. This is our next big project after we go see the Crocs. We can go see the Crocs right now if we wanted to. Alright, so this is the center. So we got one, two, three, four. So one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, seven. Nice. Can you double ghost image anymore? No, okay. That's always good to know. Alright, this is where the village is going to go. This is all going to be deleted. We don't need it. Well, actually, you know what? That would look pretty cool, too. Let's do that, yeah. We'll make a, like a little... Thing here. One, two, three, four. What? No, hold on. Is this the center of the base? That's the center. Or that way. One, two, three, four, five. So we need to go out one more this way if we can. Because they're going to be like little huts. They're going to be maybe three by six huts. Yeah. Four huts and we'll decorate them. Make them look all fancy. So if we're doing that. This is going to be a three way walkway here. We'll lay down the foundation for the um the work here. And then I say right about I can't do stairs unless I fill the foundations in. And I can't fill the foundations in right this second. Alright. I know we probably should go get the crops. And like bring back um What I'm doing is I'm going to finalize one of the greenhouses here. I just need a couple of planks. That's it. That should be enough planks to finalize the last greenhouse. 
And then I gotta decide what I'm doing with these two center greenhouses. This one over here is gonna be onions again. I just needed uh, a couple more nails and some planks. So this one's done. Just the mercy of finding onion seeds. There's a melon seed out here. Well, maybe this would be a good area for another village. Right out here in this area. Nah, we'll keep over here for now. What else do we need to build? We have the mineral extractor array. Which is going to take us forever to fill in. <laughs> and I do mean forever. <laughs> hmm. We need more onion sprouts. I'm just thinking here. Hmm. Mm hmm. We're close to getting another mineral extractor or a clay extractor. Um, we need. Iron. How's this doing over here for iron? Looks like Mike's been filling up these boxes with rock. I'll make sure we uh, do him a favor by emptying them. Ooh, we're gonna go slow to the forge here. We're 0 0.6 grams over. What are we carrying? Eat that watermelon or melon and we can move it more. <laughs> Make some more glass because that's what's going to be in the village. Or in the... Yeah, I think this out here. Hmm. So if we come off here... We put one here, 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 and here. I'll delete this. I'll delete this. I'll delete that. You need to go out one more this way. Yeah, that'll work. This room right here is going to be for the kitchen area. The butchering, the, and all that. We'll set up some like kitchen tables in here, put some glass around here. You know what, what would it look like if I did it like this? And decorated it with just some... Um, Some added curves. Because it doesn't need to be that big. So we'll delete this one. And we will put this one in. And we'll delete this one. And put this one in. I don't know where that a big oil pump is going to go. Probably out here, away from everything, way out here in the distance. But I think this would be a good room just for the butchering table. What we could do is we could make a run all the way back over to here.
and then the stairs would go right here and right here right in the center of these bad boys yeah that'll work let's get rid of this this walk stairway here and we will put down a flat foundation so that right there is going to be the growing area hmm we'll know what it looks like until we start putting it together i guess we're not ready to put that together though We are not ready to put that together. We're going to move slowly here for a little bit. We'll get to the croc skins eventually. If we had the croc thing, we'd still be overburdened. It's because we're carrying all this sand on us. Whoops, not the nails. How are these doing? They're doing good. Put the sand away. Make sure we empty this out already. We have some more iron fragments down here. I think we're thirsty. I could be wrong. Yeah, we're thirsty. Alright, so when we get done with this episode, the next episode we'll go and see if we can't find some more tech blueprints. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go and grab a whole bunch of planks real quick. And we are going to fill in as many mineral extractors as we can with the nails and the planks. That one's full. That one's full. That one's full. That one's full. We need more planks. Grab some planks from here real quick. We have no overflow planks anymore. Like I said, we're going to get all these filled in. I think we left off on that one. Yeah. So we're going to go into this one. That one needs screws. That needs more planks. That needs more planks. Alright, let's go grab some more planks. I think that area out there is going to look good. I'm not sold on this one right here. Until we start putting it together and see where we end up with. Or what we end up with. There's a um, pumpkin out here. Grab some more planks real quick. Put that seed up because we don't need it. Let this go for a second. And then we'll um, put this log in here. There we go. So yeah, this is an ambitious project um, for 
that's a massive amount of iron. Alright, so these ones are done. Once we finalize these ones, then we'll worry about the other ones. So we want to grab... We want to go put the rock away real quick. And the iron fragments. Grab the glass. Put it in the bottom box here. Grab that glass. All right, we don't need any more planks right this second. So that can, this can all be put away. And then what we're going to do is we're going to clean out the plank stand here and we're going to transfer it over here to these plank stands here for an overflow buffer. Dad and I want it to look good out here with all the planks being filled up and whatnot. Makes the atmosphere a little bit better. But yeah, right about... Right about there is going to be a railing. And that will lead off to the cabin area. Nice. Okay. So far so good. Right, what are we smelting in here? Nothing. Let's grab some iron fragments. Keep this box full up. You don't ever want that to run out. We got some more sand here. And then we have... Take that one out. Actually, you know what? We can put that one in there and we'll just take from the top. And then we're just going to dump all this in here. Be with you momentarily, dear. I could use your giblets. We don't need any more nails on us right this second. So we're going to drop the nails off in there. Let's go run around the area and see if we can't find Hunting 101. When you think you got an animal in your sights, you do. <laughs> Nailed it. I'd rather have the chicken over the deer, but you know what? It's a deer. Take my arrow out of his noggin. Looks like we need some proteins. Good thing we have protein back up in here. Let's take from this one. One more piece how to do it. Eat a little cucumber for the um the stats. The barn needs five potatoes. Let's go grab five potatoes out of here. One, two, three, four, five. Just five of any veggie will work. I just grab those. And one, two, three. Four and five. I think we need to do a milk run to the trader. <laughs> we have plenty of milk left over. One thing we're not finding is mushroom seeds.
the winter is over, we could probably break down this wall here and start making the glass area. You know, break down this wall right here. So what do we need? Screws. Mm. Do we have any copper left? We do. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. This should be done with the iron. Let's drop some copper off in here. What do we need for these? Lead. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're gonna need to jump these off in here for now. Because we're gonna go over here and grab some more. And we're gonna grab this. And we are gonna go out here. This one's done. Oh yeah, we're going to continue down the line here. How is the regular clay extractor doing? It's full and out of juice. Okay. What were we looking for? Biofuel. One, two, three, four. I hear you, chicken. Come say hi to me. Don't say no. There we go. We got clay up and running again. Because we're going to need a lot of clay. Let's go find this chicken real quick. So that we can make a couple of ration packs. That was a potato there for a second. There it is. He stopped at the wrong point, boy. Missed. Didn't miss you that time. Throw the feathers off in there. Alright, so we need... What do we need? We need two melons. There's a lot of spoiled food in here. I'm seeing a pattern emerging. There's one. Yeah, we need to clean out his area. We need another melon, though. Let's go grab another melon from over here. I wonder how we're doing on our power issue. Let's turn on the oil extractor for now. There's our copper. You can turn copper into screws, just like so. Now we have plenty of screws. Now we don't have to worry about them now for a little while. We got nails. We need iron ingots. These are both, oh, uh, that's got lead. Yeah, let's grab the lead real quick and add it to these, um, these things here, the wind turbines. All right, so we need screws. Finalize that wall. No, it's going the wrong way.
We have a log in our hands. Let's just get rid of it right here. Make, we have planks on ourselves too. So we need two still ingots and some glass. Two still ingots and some glass. We're working on our glass right here and two still ingots. There we go. Now we want a glass door. We have everything but the two steel, which we're going to make right now. Or we're going to grab out of there. And that'll be the last one we can do for now until we get some steel. But. Yeah. I think that looks much better. Mm-hmm. Yep. I think it looks a lot better. A lot better. All right, so what are we doing next? We can put the screws up for now. Because we cannot use them because we don't have any steel. We can make steel if we had enough lead, but that means we'd have to go back to the, um, back to the cave to get some more lead. Which I'm thinking we might do not next episode because we're gonna head down and do the crops. Let's take all that out of there and put it in here. Minus the fragment. The fragments can go in here. I mean, I guess we could grab some more. We're going to walk slow for a second. You know what? I'm going to use a med kit. Drop my health off. Make up glass real quick. If you're wondering what I'm doing, I'm making brick. I am making brick. Because I want to get this building up and running. This main building here. I need to get it organized. What wrong one? I want the clip. I want to get it organized. I wanted to get it set up properly. What were we doing? We we're making brick. We were making brick. You can only make ten brick at a time because that's all our backpack can hold. If we had the bigger backpack, we would probably do two sets. But it doesn't take that long to go over here and do this. We are running low on. Food. So let's do this real quick. Go out here. Eat one of these. Put the can away. Alright. So we're making glass. Is there any water in our cup? No. And we forgot to make those ration packs. What are we missing? Oh, eggs. <laughs> Knew there was something we were missing. That's a five hour one. That's a five hour one. Five hours is a long time. Where's our rations at? We did eat a couple of rations over um, the course of the winter. But not not too many. Just like maybe a stack of them. These are wet brick. They're drying. Let's grab the glass out of here. Hmm. 
I'm trying to think of what else we can do to speed up the process here. Actually, I want to grab that back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We'll drop that off in there. Since we have this sand at our disposal here, we're going to make more glass because we're going to be doing a lot of glass work here pretty soon. I need one more sand. I miscounted. Alright, so that's cooking. Our water is clean. It's been a couple days since we went to the cave. Eventually, this all right here and this right here is going to move somewhere else. Of course, it looks good right there, I guess you could say. Just in between Mike's house. We just need to fill up the um, plank stand to make them look good. Let's do that real quick while we're thinking about it. Make it look like this is a storage area here. So the glass should be smelted already. How are we doing on our glass production? Take it all for three. We missed a plank on ourselves. Grab these planks. Alright, let's run out here so they don't wreck the building. Where are they? Here comes one, two. And the table saw is out of fuel. Do we have any fuel in here? We have 15, huh? Let's test the theory here. Let's just see if it just takes four. Or did it just take the whole eight? I think it just took the whole eight. Wow. Okay. Lesson learned on that one. <laughs> oh well. It's not like we can't produce more oil, so. I mean, theoretically, we could probably just start smelting all this iron that we have uh, at our disposal over here. I mean, it's not doing anything. Ah, oh, that's what we need. Yeah. A storage room for all the... For all the, um... Glass and whatnot. You know what? I think that would look good out here. There's a pumpkin here. A watermelon. Let me pick up that watermelon. And go running back to the base. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking here. Hmm. I'll pick you up in a second, cucumber. I'm thinking here. I got ideas in my brain rattling around. We need a storage area. 
what if we went out this way? I'll get you some water in a second. Hmm. I wonder how far we can go out this way without getting out of the um This be the storage room out here. We can take this one out for now. And we take these up for now. We're not gonna need them. <laughs> the storage room is gonna be a standalone area. We're running low on water. Uh, do I have any water on me? I do. Drink up, buddy. Alright, so I wanted a little ways away from the building here. So we're going to chop this back by a little bit. And we're going to build out here a little bit more. Because I want some open area here in the center. Just for some, like, maybe decorative things and whatnot. I want at least a little bit open way. So we're just going to go out the other way a little bit more. We're going to chop this tree down because it's going to be in the way. Then I need the bark chips and the plant fiber. Alright, so this is going to go right here, right here, right here, right here, and right here. And then we'll go out a little bit this way. This is going to be the storage room. Yeah, it's own little structure. Three that way, three that way. We need one more this way. There we go. And then we can actually delete this. Actually, you know what? Let's put that... Mm, I think what we want to do, I want to kind of leave this area open. So taking out that stairs was a mistake, so we're going to have to put that back. So I want this area open right here. So it looks like its own little area. And then what we can do later on is build another area over here for the truck garage and whatnot. And whatnot. I can't even remember where the truck is. It's been so long since we found it. Yeah, I'm not keen on this one. Can we put up ghost imagery steps? No, we can't put up ghost imagery stamp without the foundation being filled in. Throw the bark chips in there, throw the plant fiber in there, throw the seeds in there. Alright, that's one box that's empty. I think we're going to go out to the Crocs in the next episode. Or another town. One of the two. Um... We need to do something. The greenhouses are already built. So that's out of the way. They look good. I don't know about this area right here. This one. Right here. Oh, that's what we can do. Yeah, let's do that. Delete that. Delete that. 
inspection one. What if we take this back by one and just negative? Why would we do that? Put those back. For now, hold on. Just trying to think. Like this needs. Oh, there's an onion seed underneath there. It's just like um, we need to move this back by one more. So basically, what I'm thinking is another foundation here, and then the curved foundation. To give it a little bit of bigger area. And then we can have ramps. Well, I can't put them in right this second, but get rid of all the stuff that's on me. And we have another onion seed on us. So we're going to go plant that in the onion farm. Grab these watermelons real quick. Alright everyone. This is where I'm going to call this video everyone. I do hope you have enjoyed this episode. If you did make sure you storm that like button. And if you're new here. Subscribe for more daily videos. Okay everyone. Take care. Bye bye. And thanks to all my Patreons.